Alori Sitarama Raju was an Indian revolutionary involved in the Indian independence movement. After the passing of the 1882 Madras Forest Act, its restrictions on the free movement of tribal peoples in the forest prevented them from engaging in their traditional Podu agricultural system, which involved shifting cultivation. Raju led the Rampa Rebellion of 1922–24, during which a band of tribal leaders and other sympathizers fought against the British Raj, which had passed the law. He was referred to as Manyam Virudu, hero of the jungles, by the local people. Raju led a protest movement in the border areas of the East Godavari and Visakhapatnam regions of Madras Presidency, in present-day Andhra Pradesh. Inspired by the patriotic zeal of revolutionaries in Bengal, Raju raided police stations in and around Chintapale, Rampachodavaram, Damanapali, Krishna Devi Pita, Rajavamangi, Aditigala, Narsipatnam and Anavaram. With his followers, he stole guns and ammunition and killed several British Army officers, including Scott Coward near Damanapali. Raju was eventually trapped by the British in the forests of Chintapali, then tied to a tree and was executed by gunfire in Koyuru village. His tomb is in Krishna Devi Pita village. <laughs> Life Details of Alori Sitarama Raju's early life vary. Several sources report his birthdate as 4 July 1897 in Bhimunipatnam, Visakhapatnam district, with more recent news stories naming the village of Pandrangi, which lies in the Bhimunipatnam Legislative Assembly constituency, as his precise place of birth. Some other sources claim his birthdate as 4 July 1898. At the age of 12, Raju lost his father. Then his paternal uncle took him to Narsipur and later he moved to Kovada. He didn't show much interest towards studies but was interested in Vedanta and Yoga. While in Tuni, in 1918, he used to tour the hills where he came into contact with tribals and witnessed their pitiable condition firsthand. Finally he quit studies and started his campaign in East Godavari and Visage. Rampa Rebellion of 1922 After the passing of the 1882 Madras Forest Act, its restrictions on the free movement of tribal peoples in the forest prevented them from engaging in their traditional Podu agricultural system, which involved shifting cultivation. Raju led a protest movement in the border areas of the East Godavari and Visakhapatnam districts of Andhra Pradesh. Inspired by the patriotic zeal of revolutionaries in Bengal, Raju raided police stations in and around Chintapale, Rampachodavaram, Damanapali, Krishna Devi Pita, Rajavamangi, Aditigala, Narsipatnam and Anavaram. Raju and his followers stole guns and ammunition and killed several British Army officers, including Scott Coward near Damanapali. In December 1922, the British deployed a company of Assam rifles, near Pagadapala under the leadership of Saunders. Raju, who had by then gone underground, resurfaced after about four months and continued the fight, strengthened by tribal volunteers using bows and arrows under the leadership of Gam Malu Dora and Gantam Dora. <laughs> Death Following a raid led by Raju on the Anavaram police outpost on 18 September 1923, Gam Malu Dora was arrested. The government entrusted the task of containing Raju's activities to the district collector of Visakhapatnam district, Rutherford, who fired the first salvo when his forces arrested Surya Narayana Raju Parachurla, popularly known as Agiraju, a devoted follower of Raju. The British campaign lasted for nearly a year from December 1922. Raju was eventually trapped by the British in the forests of Chintapali. He was tied to a tree and shot dead in Koyuru village. Police officer Nanaswara Rao, who had been responsible for the entrapment of Raju, was given the title of Rao Bahadur by the British. Raju's tomb is in Krishna Devi Pita village. In popular culture In 1986 the Indian Postal Department issued a commemorative stamp featuring Raju in the series India's Struggle for Freedom. The Telugu language movie Alori Sitharama Raju, featuring actor Krishna, depicted Raju's life. Andhra Pradesh is to celebrate his birthday, 4 July, annually as a state festival. 
Alori Sitarama Raju Cricket Stadium in Aluru is named after him. On 9 October 2017, at the request of Members of Parliament, though to Narasimham and V. Vijayasai Reddy, the Government of India decided to install a statue of Raju at the precincts of the Parliament of India in recognition of his work as a freedom fighter, and for the welfare of the tribal people. <laughs>